In this video, we're going to demonstrate how to place a cartoon image in ArtRage and do a demo tracing of it that we'll use later to place in um, our cartoon video. So first of all, we go to, we open ArtRage, then we go to File, New Painting. Uh, once we get into new painting, you see a, a window menu. And we want to change the size of the canvas. We want to use YouTube uh, canvas size. So we're going to change it to 1280 by 720 pixels at 72 pixels resolution. Once we change the setting, uh, we go down and we'll click OK. Now we can see the canvas. You see the brown behind it. That's behind the canvas, but the canvas size is there. But we want to change the size of the canvas so we can um, see where to place our tracing image. So I'm going to go up to the positioner icon, which is the easel at the top on the top menu. See the little easel. Click that and we get a round uh, menu window. And what you do is uh, click on the magnifier icon and then move your mouse around and that will uh, change the size of the canvas. So we want to see the whole canvas to begin with uh, in order to place the tracing image. You can also move the canvas around by going to the positioner icon, click on it and move around while you have your mouse button held down. Then to get out of that menu, you just click the X. Okay, now we want to um, import the tracing image or the cartoon image that we're going to trace. Once we have the uh, canvas positioned so that we can see it completely, we want to load the cartoon image we're going to use to tr do the tracing. So we go up to the right side of the screen and I right click on tracing. And that gives me this menu to load tracing image. So I'm going to select load tracing image. That gives me my file uh, window menu. I go up to the top of the screen, I open up the drop down box, and I go to OneDrive. I'm going to go open that up OneDrive, uh, Children's Drawing Website, New. And I'm going to go to Production Files, open that up, and I'm going to go to the production files that's associated with the cartoon we're gonna, going to. Um, demonstrate or we're going to trace here or the one we're doing the video for right so it's the pig with curly tail we're going to start the video process on that cartoon image so I'm going to select that I'm going to go up to number one edited downloaded image these are this is the cartoon picture that we're going to use to do everything from in terms of the video I'm going to open that up and I'm going to select pig with curly tail and then I'm going to open that. And now we've opened up the tracing image onto the canvas. Now once the image has been loaded, the tracing image, uh, we want to go up to uh, tracing and we want to reposition this image on our canvas. So we right click on Tracing, then we go to uh, uh, Tracing Image File, and then we go to Manual Scale. Manual Scale. And we click on that. That's going to allow us to uh, make some changes. So as soon as it clicks, it puts a box around the image. We can place our cursor in the middle and move it around, and we also can make it bigger. And you do that by grabbing the corners and pulling the corners out. It 
Sometimes this image is much larger than the canvas, so you have to pull it down and grab the corner to make it smaller to fit in the canvas. We want to position this on the right side of the canvas so it is no larger than uh, half of the canvas sides. So that's a little too big right now. I'm going to have to bring it in a little bit. So we, if we imagine a line down the middle of the canvas, it needs to be uh, within half size of the canvas. So that's about right. Now to get out of the box, you just click outside the box. And now that's placed our tracing image on the right side of the canvas. Now we want to bring that image larger so when we trace it, it's, it's easier for us to see. So we're going to go to the top menu, select the positioner tool again where the uh, easel is. So we're going to enlarge it, make it bigger, and we're going to move it around to place it in front of us so that it'll be easy to trace. Make it a little larger, and I click out.